Hey, welcome. So, we are back with more Seven Days to Die. And, uh, well, I was uh, on a trip in the uh, wastelands of Seven Days to Die. Don't even know if it's called a wasteland. Don't even know if you would call it a wasteland. Breather. But anyways, uh, out looking around in the uh, Seven Days to Die world, of uh, my world. Um, and if you don't know... There's a rumor going around that uh, I'm building a farm in Seven Days to Die. Shh! Be very quiet about it. Uh, because it's a secret. Not really. Uh, but anyways. Um, out in uh, Seven Days to Die. Looking around for uh, the final two seeds of my collection. So I can get my farm going. Blueberry and uh, potato seeds. And uh, I thought I would show this with you guys. Because why not? You know? Um... Fighting zombies in seven days to nine, never boring. Um, so the plus side of uh, showing this with you guys is well, one on my channel, and two, uh, I have found my new favorite weapon. Absolutely, hands down, possibly the best weapon in seven days to die, uh, or at least melee weapon. Um, it doesn't bug out on noise, you know, so if some of you are familiar with machine guns in uh, Seven Days to Die, uh, they kind of, um, Seven Days to Die machine guns kind of noise repeat, so sometimes they may bug out. Uh, so it doesn't do that. Uh, you don't have to make bullets for it. Um, pretty easy to make. You don't have to read a book that I know of um, to make it. So, yeah, so, all in all, a pretty decent weapon, okay? What is this weapon? Well, the weapon is, uh, well, a spiked club. Um, yeah, it pretty much one-shots, uh, just about any zombie, uh, headshots, that is. Um, not always, but most of the time, it one-shots zombies. It is like... I was afraid of zombies, and now that I carry this everywhere I go, zombies, as long as I headshot them, no problem. N absolutely not a single problem with zombies ever, ever again when you build this course. Then you may look at my, um, my um, blunt object um, stats, and you might say, well, they might be a little bit higher up. I don't I don't think they're that much higher up okay I used to carry a knife um, all the time when I played this game um, really really hard to one shot zombies in the head and explode their head this um, blunt weapon um, kind of because it has uh, a spike on it well mul multiple spikes uh, is is really really good. And uh, the only zombie I haven't been able to one-shot with it yet um, are the policeman. And, well, because I haven't seen any other zombies, um, I haven't seen, like, the, the really super um, strong ones in the snow or anything like that. But the ones that I have been facing, one-shot almost every single time uh, but anyways on to this video uh, I'm out looking for some seeds I need to find blueberry seeds because they are a uh, main ingredient in blueberry pie otherwise it will in this game it will be not blueberry pie it will be cornbread um, because I believe you use cornmeal uh, or something in this game for um, blueberry pie I could be lying I don't know uh, it's been a while since I looked at the recipe but that is my goal that is my that is my primary goal why I want to make a farm is because blueberry pie is possibly one of the best foods in the game why um, one it doesn't make you thirsty and two um, oh, wellness. Yeah, one, doesn't make you thirsty, and two, uh, it 
boosts up your wellness. So in the game, there's wellness, which means you have to uh, be at full health all the time. You have to uh, drink all the time and eat all the time. And then if you're like me and you die all the time and your health goes down all the time, uh, it stays at 70. And so that means you have 70 health instead of like 100 health. So if you boost your wellness, okay, and it's like every other piece of um, blueberry pie that you eat, it goes up one or two, whatever, it doesn't really matter, it still goes up. Uh, you're doing very good, and now you increased your health. Um, and plus with this spiked club in my hand, I plan not to die very often anymore. So... I got the Spike Club, I'm working on my way to Blueberry Pie, and I'm working on my way to 100% health, which is very nice, which means I could run longer because I will have more sprint. Um, I will be able to fight longer because I will have more stam, and all that fun stuff. So, with all that said, um, yeah, I'm looking pretty good about now except for uh, zombies every single night which is truly and truly truly not fair um, no uh, I don't I don't mind it actually because that means I just get to kill zombies and have fun and create videos for you guys if I didn't have zombies to kill well uh, no videos yeah um, so no actually I do like it and uh, I, I will try to uh, get creative with the videos a little bit. I'm going to try to do something. I have no idea. Uh, probably not. We will see. Um, so yeah. Um, this video was telling me, telling you guys about my awesome club. Okay. Um, not only on Microsoft or uh, on Xbox One club, but uh, the club that is in my hands as of right now, uh, in Seven Days to Die, uh, the spiked clubs, they call it a, a spiked club when there's multiple spikes because it's barbed wire. Um, yeah, so, so this club that I'm holding in Seven Days to Die is possibly the greatest. And I also wanted to tell you that I'm building a farm. And the reason... Uh, I'm telling you that I was out finding seeds and stuff is because I am still trying to build a farm however I need those seeds I need um, as you can see I have found a potato seed but a potato seed is not a recipe for uh, blueberries uh, so I still need blueberries to make blueberry pie because it's possibly the best food in the game maybe I could also be lying, but I also could be right, you know. Uh, so yeah. Anyways, I'm gonna spend the night at the um, this graveyard, kind of spooky night. Uh, hopefully, I don't freeze to death. But um, I will see you guys next time with more Seven Days to Die. And I will leave you guys there. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Kind of a weird video. Um, but anyways, I hope you guys had or are having a wonderful day. I will see you guys next time with more 7 Days to Die. Goodbye!